Hey what's up guys, in this video we are going to talk about typedef in C++ programming. The typedef keyword is used to assign a new name to any existing data type. And the syntax is first you have the typedef keyword, then the current name of the data type and then we can assign one new name to the existing data type. Like in example, we can write typedef then the existing data type like long int and then we can assign one new name to the existing data type like li and by doing so instead of writing long int we can write the new name li throughout our program and also we can use the type def with one structure and the syntax is first we have the type def keyword then the structure definition and after the curly braces we assign one new name to the structure and by doing so, instead of using the name of the structure, we can use the new name of the structure throughout our program. So we can use the type def keyword and we can assign a new name to the long int data type and the new name can be li. So by doing that, wherever we wanted to use the data type long int in our program, instead of writing long int, we can use the new name which is li. So we can use the li and we can create one variable and we can assign it one value. And then we can print the value of the variable. And if we just run the program, the program will just work fine. So this way we can use the type def keyword along with one existing data type and we can assign one new name to the existing data type. And also we can use the type def keyword with one structure. So first we have the type def keyword, then the structure declaration like structure student and the structure can have the members like string name and integer role. So after the declaration of the structure, we can assign a new name to the existing structure and the new name can be stu. So wherever we wanted to create the variable of the student type, Instead of writing student, we can just write the new name which is stu. And that is possible because of the type def keyword. So if we wanted to create one student type variable, then instead of writing student, we can just write stu and then the name of the variable. And we can assign it the name like tom and the role like 10. And then we can use the cout and we can print the name. And also we can print the role of the student. And if we just run the program, the program just works fine. So this way we can use the type div with one structure and we can assign one new name to the structure. And we can use the new name and we can create the variable of that structure. So hope you understand the concept. We'll see you in the next one. Thank you.